Hey YouTube, how's it going? Uh, this is Gamester81. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's video review, we're going to look at, take a closer look at the Apple IIc computer. Um, I'd have to say the Commodore 64 is probably my favorite vintage computer by far. However, this is a very close second based simply on sentimental reasons for me. I grew up with this computer growing up in school. Uh, many of you who are around my age or older will remember this uh, computer being very popular. And I learned how to type on this computer. There's a lot of educational games on this game on this computer, as well as a lot of fun games as well. Um, we're going to look at one of the, my favorite games on this computer uh, later on in this video. Uh, this computer came out in 1984. It's uh, the Apple IIc, but there were the first Apple computer came out in 1976. And although it um, it didn't sell very well, it was basically a homebrew kind of computer, and very hard to find even today. Uh, first Apple II computer came out in 1977. And then there were several other models. There was Apple II, the Apple uh, Apple IIe, Apple II, uh, Apple IIc. Um, there's an Apple II Plus, Apple IIc Plus, Apple II GS. I mean, there's there's a number of you guys can kind of get the idea. There's a whole bunch of models that were released uh, for this. Now the line was eventually discontinued in 1993. Um, they sold in from 1977 to 1993 five to six million uh, computers, and this was basically this reason really got Apple on board. It was eventually the Mac line that replaced this, this uh, computer line. But let's take a closer look All at it. Right. So here's a closer look at this this computer, the Apple IIc. Um, it's got a really cool retro uh, Apple II Lego, which or Apple computer, which they used actually up until 1998. It's got the rainbow colors, which is really cool. Um, this is the model number right here. And now uh, this is this particular model was they considered portable because they're, if you look here, there's actually a the stand acts as a holder, so you can actually take it with you. However, it wasn't mobile because there was no built-in battery and there was no built-in screen, like I showed you with the Commodore um, 64 uh, SX64 computer. Um, the thing about this this computer, which is kind of revolutionary at the time, is it had the Dvorak uh, systematic keyboard setup layout. So uh, what you see in this this computer keyboard right here is pretty much what we have today. It was one of the very first computers to have the same layout so question mark is where you know the question mark is today and all that so it's pretty revolutionary in that sense this computer the Apple II computers ranged in, in price as far as fourteen hundred to around twenty seven hundred dollars back in the the eighties which is a lot of money um, let's see here's here's your reset button this is your eighty forty switch I'm not sure what that does maybe it's the resolution I'm not quite sure uh, if you guys know what that is uh, please let me know uh, you get your keyboard and then this is your disk use and your power use so uh, this will be on when the power is on and this use will be flashing when it's loading uh, speaking of this um, this is where your disc would go and oh look what I got Oregon Trail we're gonna take a look at that a little later on these are five and a, and a quarter inch floppy disk drives now the RAM on this thing is about 128 RAM which uh, ki I'm sorry kilobytes so 128 kilobytes RAM uh, which is not much considering we're, we're in what uh, the PS3 has 120 gigs. I mean, it's just amazing what we've gone uh, in just computers today as well. Uh, how many gigs they have? Um, let's see the side here. I'm trying not to manhandle this, guys. <laughs> uh, this is the volume and your, your earphone jack, which is kind of cool. Uh, let's turn turn it over in the back here, and then this is what I was talking about the handle. Uh, this is where your joystick and your mouse would go. Uh, you can hook it up to a phone line, which is interesting. Um, you can your monitor would plug in right here, and your, your printer, which I'm going to show you in a minute. And this is the on-off, and this is the power supply right here. Um, graphics are nothing to really to write home about, to be honest with you, especially in today's times. But I'll tell you what, the fun factor on these games are great. I remember growing up playing, uh, you know, educational games like Reader Rabbit. Um, you've got a Sticky Bear. Um, you know, there's a lot of fun games like that. Obviously, the Oregon Trail is one of them. And then you've got Sierra games, which I'm just a big fan of. you got King's Quest, Space Quest, um, just a ton of great Sierra games um, with like point and click kind of things. Although th th at this point, they weren't necessarily point and click. It was more like type and, and hit enter. <laughs> and if you don't hit the right thing or type in the right thing, it wouldn't work your command. So command prompt games, but they were fun. Um, this is the joystick that I have for it. And uh, it's pretty standard. This is the mouse, only one one click mouse, but this is, again, you know, it's one of the first computers um, to have uh, a mouse like this, so that, that's cool. Here's here's the monitor itself, um, a closer look. You got your on off on the side here, and then you got, of course, you got your printer right here, and this is like those dot matrix computers, 
And uh, I remember growing up, my mom would have this like program where you could pro you could make gift cards and stuff. And and it's one of those, you know, dot you know, there's papers with holes on the side, and you got to line it up just right, otherwise it wouldn't print out. Um, classic, classic printer. Uh, let's take a closer look at. Uh, sorry about that black line, guys. That's just the the, the camera causing that. Now the si sound will come out of uh, the computer here itself, um, not the monitor. And um, and this computer was actually followed up, uh, came out after the Apple II, which came out in 1983. This one came out in 1984. And it came out before the Apple II GS. Um, so what do we need to do? Um, let's do travel. Yeah, I always, I'm always a banker. First name, Gamester81. Oh, let me put it. Who do I want? Uh, let's do Luke Morris1. Oh, let's do MN12. Oh, you can't do numbers. That's that's a lame. Uh, let's do MN Bird. And let's do uh, Pete Door. And let's have. Um, Happy console. It's not gonna work. Happy console gamer. So happy C. Happy console gamer. There you go. And are these names correct? Yes. So I guess they don't like the numbers and names apparently. Um, you know, I guess it kind of misses travel in March. So let's just buy something real quick. Okay. Um, Oxen. Let's do five. I'm a banker, so I have a lot more money than usual. Two thousand pounds of food. Clothing. Let's do uh, new ten sets. Yeah, ammunition. 20, let's do more ammunition. I like the hunt. Hunting is a lot of fun on this thing. Spare parts. Let's do. All right, and we're good to go. Music is classical here here in a minute. All right. Wow. Bringing back the memories here. Okay, so let's continue on trail. So basically what it is. Uh, it, you're, and you shows your health, your weather, um, and oh, I already broke. Um, yes. Let's see, you lose days, how many miles? I always got sick in this, or um, you know, I got you know pneumonia or something. Let's look around. And I <laughs> Wow, that's like a picture perfect. I'm sure that's what exactly what it looked like. Let's um let's continue on trail. Or let's look at map. See, it's we've got a long way to go. I'm gonna show you your hunting in here in a minute. Oh, we must cross. Okay, so what should, what should we do? Um, it's five feet deep. Let's see if we can caulk, caulk it and uh, float across.
Oh, what? Dude, I lost all my wheel. That, that's bullshit, crap, man. Let's see if I want to stop and hunt. Let's go hunt for food. I'll say this is. I'm using uh, the control arrows for this. Oh, wait. IO, it says you're here. What you need to use. IO, P, K. So, yeah. Kind of crazy controls here. Oh. Oh, damn you. You only certain. Nice. Nice.